Nisha Sadiqwa, the UN climate advisor, has sparked controversy with her recent statements, which some view as divisive and steeped in identity politics rather than offering pragmatic solutions to environmental challenges. Person. And I say this because the climate crisis is not us. The climate crisis is not a result of natural disasters from the enemy. It's a result of. I'll say it again because I think they missed it. <laughs> the climate crisis is man made. And it's not just man made, it's white man made. It's white man made. It's a result of capitalism, years of colonialism, years of racial oppression. And so if you want to get involved, the way that we save our planet is when we protect the most vulnerable communities among us. And this includes Black trans women. This includes Indigenous people. And this is why it includes children and young people. Because when we protect them, then we can protect everybody else. All right. Sadiqwa's emphasis on the role of white men in exacerbating the climate crisis is perceived as a tactic of using identity-based scapegoats potentially obstructing efforts to address the multifaceted issues contributing to environmental degradation. Critics suggest that her rhetoric may be driven by partisan agendas, potentially undermining constructive discourse and collaboration. Her approach is characterized by some as adhering to a left-leaning, agitation-driven framework in environmental policy, prioritizing scientific inquiry and collective action to address climate change. However, others argue that such an approach risks oversimplification and polarization, potentially detracting from effective solutions. <laughs>